Well, well, well. What do we have here? A guest? I apologize for the shabby location. Not all of us can live in a fancy castle. If I had known you were coming, I'd have a meal prepared. Though, thankfully, you've brought some steaks with a side of garlic. But what brings you here? You can't have come out of curiosity. You're too well prepared. Have I slept with a spouse of yours? No. I haven't left this place in decades. I can't have fed on a pet of yours. I would never stoop so low to feed on a cat dog. You are absolutely right. Here you are as an uninvited guest in my humble abode. And here I am hiding my face. Where are my manners? Greetings, my unexpected visitor. I shall be your gracious host this fine evening. And who might you- Oh! <laughs> so, uh, do you do this with everyone, or am I special? <laughs> Monster. I'm not the one who trespassed into a stranger's home and tried to kill them. I at least knock. <laughs> oh, please. You're a guest. It would be rude of me not to have idle conversation with you. Take you seriously? Why would I ever take this seriously? I'm in no real danger. <laughs> so, any last words before I gut you like a swine? No? You know, I was hoping this would be more fun. You vow to slay me out of vengeance or glory, I come up with some witty banter, which you would retort with some clever remarks yourself, but you just had to be so serious. You really want to kill me, huh? You weren't hired, seeing how much of an amateur you are. Or at least I hope to God not, because that would be totally insulting. You're not here for glory, you're too emotional. Hmm, that look of disgust and hate. You have a vendetta against me. What, did I wrong some ancestor and this is some long line of familial vengeance? Can't be. As much as I like to play with my food, I'm at least thorough. So, this must mean some other random vampire killed your family and this is you throwing a tantrum. Am I correct? <laughs> of course I am. Though I do think it's a bit childish to kill a group because of the actions of a few. What? If a wolf killed your family, would you hunt down other wolves? Would you start killing other people's puppies if you ran out? <laughs> Amazing. Even when you're obviously outmatched, you're still defiant to the end. Quite the spitfire, aren't- <laughs> You fucker! You stabbed me! You actually stabbed me! <laughs> I didn't think you had it in you, but you really are dedicated to kill me. <sighs> Tell me, if you had a chance to kill me, once and for all, at the risk of your own life, would you do it? Interesting. Well, you convinced me. Good news. You won't be dying today. Well, at least not by my hand. I know how frail you humans can be, and with that death wish of yours, I'm not sure how long you'll last. Hmm? Well, I have a proposition. I teach you how to kill vampires, and you kill other vampires for me. How does that sound? Oh, please. With your skills, I'd hesitate to even call you a novice. I'm an immortal creature of the night, and all you brought were some twigs and some herbs. Tell me, what would you have done if your plan failed? That's what I thought. Hmm? 
<laughs> Why should you join me? I know things about my kind that you would never find out in your lifetime. Like the fact that the garlic you're holding is absolutely useless. It's the flower you need, not the bulb. And that you're correct in stabbing in the left, but you stab me in your left. Shall I go on? <laughs> Aww, that's adorable. You think you're a threat. Join me and you'll actually be one. So, what do you say? Well, how about this? You refuse and I kill you where you stand. But, if you join me, we'll kill as many vampires as your adorable little human heart can handle. Perfect. Now, finishing up my introduction from earlier before I was so rudely interrupted, my name's Cassius, and I would be honored to have you as an apprentice. Yes, an, yes, an apprentice. Yes, an apprentice. As in someone who wishes to learn from their betters. You do know the English language, don't you? <laughs> well, like it or not, that's what you'll have to be if you want to make it out of here alive. And especially if you want to avenge that sweet family of yours. <laughs> so, shall we head out? My dear Hunter, I think this is the start of a beautiful relationship. <laughs>